There is an energetic portal available to you from the 6th of June, the 66 portal. Doubling the energies of this number is like doubling down the energy that is available to you. Now, if you have a dream that you'd like fulfilled, if you have unrequited love, if you have promotion with your name on it but it's not happening, if you've got dreams but you're not getting traction, if there are things in your life where it feels like the anchor is dropped and it won't let you move, this is the time of year for you to dig your heels in, to get really serious and to move forward. And in this video, I'm going to show you how. Come on, let's kick into it. Hello, you glorious soul. A warm welcome on a cold day in the country to elevate. I'm Ben, I'm here every day and I'm thankful for you. Look at you, full of promise, full of destiny, full of hope, doing your best to be your best. I know that's true of you, otherwise you wouldn't be showing up here. You wouldn't be showing up for yourself. You wouldn't be looking to do the inner work. Now friend, go easy on yourself, hey? Just back off and give yourself a little bit of grace. Be gentle with you. You will get to your promised land if you hold on to your faith and if you keep moving forward. You won't go backwards for going forwards. Now friend, like I said, I'm Ben and this is Elevate. You'll find me here every single day talking to you about this, encouraging you, showing you where you can come up higher, where you can turn the corner and meet with your dreams head on. So if you love your time here, if you're blessed by the energy, join. Subscribe to the channel. Let's connect our energy, friends. It costs you nothing to join this community. And like I said, I'm here every day. Now, you don't have to watch every video, but I know that if you look through the playlists I've put together on this channel, you will find something that meets you where you're at. Friend, this is a short message to encourage you today. See, on the 6th of June, we have an incredible energetic alignment. The 6 6 portal. The energy around this is of two things. It's of compassion and it's of light. How would you like a little bit more compassion in your world? Wouldn't that be lovely? Put your hand up and give me a little wave. I can't see you, but maybe leave me a comment or something. If that sounds good, more compassion, wouldn't that be wonderful? Who doesn't want more compassion? And who doesn't want more light? Who doesn't want more light in their finances? Who doesn't want more light in their body temple? Who doesn't want more light going before them in their career? Who doesn't want more light in the office at work? Who doesn't want more light in their relationships? Friends, light drives away the darkness. Light gives the ability to see. Light calls us forward into expansion and this season is about that expansion and it's also the energy of compassion and this is a strange energetic link. Initially, compassion and light seem like strange bedfellows but the more I've meditated on this, the more I've recognized that they hold hands beautifully and this is the majesty of the universe right before you. See, we all seek compassion. When something happens in life, we would like a compassionate response from life from those people, from those outcomes. When something doesn't go right, you by sure want a compassionate response, but even when they go wrong, even when they go right, you want compassion. We all want light. We all want to feel light. We all want to display light. The scripture says to be salt and light. We want light in our homes and our relationships and our work and our career and our health. These two things come together in the most unusual way. See, from June the 6th, your opportunity is to exceed in the abundance of compassion and light so that you can have light in those financial areas and see release. You can have light in your healing and your health. You can have light in your relationships. You can have light at your job and in your career. You can have light expanding your business. You can have favor with that insurance payer. You can have favor with that new boss or that colleague. All of this comes from light. 
The way that you get to the light is through compassion. Hang with me, I promise you this will hold water. The way you get to that level of light, where the light illuminates every dark corner of your existence, is through compassion. And so many people, when I've counseled with them over the years, beautiful, humble, soft people, have endeavoured to live a life of compassion, and they've been, pardon me, but crapped on. Sometimes the softest amongst us are the ones that are the most abused, the most manipulated, the most neglected. Is that you? Friend, the tables are turning. The winds are beginning to collect and blow in your sails because let me tell you, we all seek light externally. We all seek light in all of these areas. We all want compassion in all of these areas. Even if you give light and give compassion, what you're really seeking is receipt of that. From the 6th of June, your opportunity will be to expand in light and compassion by going inwards and not outwards. Did you hear me? From the 6th of June, your opportunity for expansion into your promised land comes by way of honouring compassion and light. Seeking those two things, seeking the evidence of those two things, not with your eyes in the world around about you, but rather turning your eyes upon your own heart. Be compassionate with yourself. You've been going through some stuff, friend, recently, haven't you? Now, I know that it's true. This is not a mistake. I see you. I might be looking at a camera, but I see your energy. I see your soul. I know you've had things spoken over you that are not fair. I know even recently, people have done things that's felt like, it's almost felt like a stabbing in the back, and you've wondered, you've felt the heaviness of that. Friend, go inside of yourself. Be gentle with you first and allow all of your actions to come from that overflow. Go inside of yourself and light a match in a dark place. Be the light that you seek. Be the compassion that you seek. Be those things to yourself first and from the overflow of that, as your cup runneth over of compassion, as your cup runneth over of light, so too will you infect the environment around about you. But you can't pour from an empty cup, my friend. Be gentle with yourself. Can I encourage you, if this is ringing true for you, if this is resonating with you, if there's something on the inside of you that stood up to attention, that's energy. That's because your spirit knows. You're human, your mind is going to say, this bloke's crazy, what's he talking about? Go out there and make it happen. Don't you do that. You honour the energy, friend, and you will move forward upon wings of eagles. You won't have to climb that mountain. You can put those wings out and soar to the very top if you go inside, not out, to seek and then honour compassion and light. I love you. I'm thankful for you. God bless you.